Chapter 11. What happened? I stir, shaking when I get home. I cook a trap. Then I poked my head into Claudia's bedroom. Claudia, you're alive! My sister smiled and gave me a big hug. I was also worried about you, she said. I turned and flew away, but I can't. Are you okay? Claudia asked. I nodded a little. I should never have taken you to the pet shop, Claudia. Hugged me tighter because I know you would turn into a monkey. She sat me on the edge of bed, and uh, when you turn to monkey, Clyde, bad things can happen. Lots of another pet at the pet shop thought they lose at lose. They lost their pet, Claudia said. But I thought I lost my brother. She, my sister, face looked super, super sad. For a minute, I looked away from Claudia at her toys, at her motor rocket. I don't feel like playing. I should afford exciting in the pet show building, Claudia, Claudia said. So where were you? I thought about the uh, warehouse. warehouse, about the pet nephews, about it, it, it's escaping from my cage. I should have been happy, but I wasn't. The pet show was clapped, Claudia said, because there are so many pets that went miss, they that went missing. I nodded slowly. I could see them in my head, looking in the could the dark nerve orbit. They looked hungry and scared. Even Raj was upset, Claudia said. She was worried about losing Chopper. I, I grinned as I thought about my my life without without the big bully dog. No more running away or being trapped in a tree. It was just I wanted. But then I, I. Picture Chopper's face as a mine. Lace. Lace from the warehouse. He looked scared. Just like the other animals. It made me feel sick. Are you okay, Clyde? Clyde asked. Yes, I said. Why? Because you're sitting still. And you never sit still. Unless. Unless something wrong, she led me closer. So what is it, Clyde? I was kidnapped and looked in a cage in an old warehouse, I said. Claudia eyes grew wider. It is horrible, I said. I thought the kidnappers are planning to sell all the animals, Claudia gasped. Then she goes, then you escaped. Yes, it is, I said. But the other animals are still in danger. I feel bad about leaving them behind. Claudia sat down next to me. But I don't want to talk about it, Clad. I said. Claudia pushed her head on my shoulder and smiled. You just did, Clyde. All right, I said. And I feel good getting it out. But I also made recognize that I needed to do next.